Hey, what is up everyone? Welcome to my workshop in my grandfather's basement. Uh, I am in the middle of the building process of my headless guitar, which is uh, right here. So that's the neck right there and the body. So this, this is how far I am right now. Uh, but I thought I'd squeeze in a little one day or one morning project. Um, so yeah, I've taken out my Ibanez RG8, RG8 sorry, uh, yesterday I played around and uh, enjoyed some of the old Solhenge tracks, uh, which is my former band, if you didn't know. So the channel is called Solhenge because of my former band. I used the, the band channel to upload these videos and uh, yeah I thought I'd give my oldest lady a good cleanup and uh, breathe some fresh life into this. Uh, this is in fact my oldest guitar believe it or not. Uh, not the oldest instrument but I've been owning this for the longest. Uh, I've got this in 2013 when I bought it off my bandmate. Uh, yeah <clears throat> which bought this absolutely ridiculous thing. So this had a fretboard, ebonizing, darkening, staining, whatever you'd call it, in I think 2014 or 15. And uh, it looks really nice. It's just like all freaking black. And I love this thing. And uh, yeah, hasn't really been used much in the last four years because we didn't play live anymore. Oh, we're not really a band anymore, unfortunately. The plan for today is to disassemble this, uh, take off the neck, uh, sand off the neck finish, which is starting to get a bit sticky, and uh, make it a tunnel finish on the back of the neck. Just up to the headstock, though. Uh, I want to preserve the serial number and uh, model name and stuff. Uh, so this should be all right. I want to polish the frets. I have my Dremel here with a polishing set, polishing paste. And I want to renew the side dots because I had this done by a luthier, the staining. And um, so he had obviously to sand off some of the fretboard. And uh, somehow the fretboard markers are really, really not visible anymore, almost. And uh, yeah, not planning on using this live, I think, in the next time. But, you know, why not? while we're at it, why not do this? So, yeah, that's the plan for today. So, I guess, let's crack on. I have everything here, I have the tunnel here, I have some inlay stick material, white, here, I have some sandpaper. I don't have new strings here, I just realized, but they are over at my house. Yeah, really excited to see this in fresh shape again.
All right, so I let the tongue oil dry for two days. I will add another coat after this video, but I want to give it a first try now. And oh my God, is this a freaking difference? It's night and day. I mean, just listen to how smooth this sounds. It is unbelievable. I should have done this, I don't know, years ago when I was playing this live because the difference in how this feels is like normal guitar and custom shop guitar because I don't know this it feels like a custom shop because of that neck it is unbelievable and uh, I absolutely recommend this mod the tongue all finish back of the neck mod because it's the best thing you can do to a guitar like this uh, it's it's much more satisfying than swapping pickups for instance because you can feel the result it was just a job for one morning, as it's on the time lapse, I had to re-stain the side of the fretboard, which looks absolutely fine now. The new inlays look fantastic. You can really see them nicely now. Really happy ha with how that turned out. And of course, those frets look super, super shiny and uh, it's a mirror-like finish. Really like that. Although it doesn't save the frets from being <laughs> worn uh, quite a lot from those years of playing and you know those big strings just grinding away the material yeah anyways i'm really happy with the guitar now uh definitely gonna play it more <clears throat> so that's basically all for today before i end this video i want to give out a special thanks to my patrons who are supporting me and my channel thank you so much people to end this video we're going to hear some stupidly low chugs on the rga8 stay healthy and i will see you next time Nie ma teraz to no. So am Video sehen. Hm? Du hast Kamera, guck doch. Schwätzen du. Da hin, guck. Nee, da, guck, du hast Kamera. Hm? So hab's denn. Da, ich guck's ja. Hm? Ne? So, ich muss nur Video machen, Meißchen. Komm.